Lion here and we have Alex Chang joining us today. What we're going to be hitting in today's technical tip is how to set the ball in a straight line. Specifically we're going to be working on the left side set so don't forget in these videos we're going to do this off one tank and we're going to make sure that we're giving you guys some things that you can write down in your notebook, some takeaways. I just want you to make sure you hit that subscribe button if you want more content like the content you're about to get. So the first thing that we're going to focus on when it comes to setting the ball in a straight line is making sure that your index fingers and your thumbs are finishing together through the set. So that's regardless of where we're setting. If we're setting the left, the right, off the shoulder, anywhere, if you can have the index and thumbs finish in a straight line together, you're gonna have your percentages come up of setting the ball in a straight line. So all the other fingers matter as well. We wanna make sure we're getting our whole hand on the ball, every portion except for the palms. But the big piece is making sure that those index and thumbs finish together. So Alex is gonna step into the setter's box. We're gonna give him three repetitions on the short side with a left right left footwork, but that's not the point. And we're gonna give them three repetitions in the system with a right left right footwork, that's also not the point. The point is making sure that his index and thumbs finish together through each set. He's really putting an emphasis on the index and thumbs finishing together. This is something that a lot of trainers around the country talk about, but ultimately it's not something that you see happen with athletes very frequently. So putting a very specific emphasis on those index fingers and those thumbs. actually did set the ball in a straight line, but both of his toes were facing about five feet off the net. So when you guys do this, you don't necessarily have to be facing the target, although that is most ideal, but you could also be making these sets from a side angle as long as your index and thumbs are finishing in a straight line. Let's go back to it. setting the ball on a line as Alex is going to grab us four more ball, volleyballs here is when you guys come off the net trying to make sure that you're taking the ball from a consistent spot on your forehead so specifically three inches in front of your uh, three inches above your forehead so if you're taking the ball off of your right ear a lot of times the ball will either fly right or you'll overcorrect and it'll fly left same thing from left to right or left to left so if you all can get it consistently in between your eyes three inches above your forehead, you're gonna have more success being able to drive the ball in a straight line. So also, belly button and toes squaring up to the target is really helpful when you're setting the left side. But even if that's not the case, if you can take the ball ball from a consistent point on top of your forehead, it's gonna help you set in a straight line. So we're gonna give him some repetitions off the net. He's gonna go twice in a row, off the net towards area one, twice in a row, off the net towards area five. I want you to be checking his index and thumbs, and I want you to be checking the location on his forehead on the side. facing a little more off the net, so he had to set it off of his eyebrow. However, he did take it from his forehead, which is why the ball was able to travel in a straight line. We're gonna go about four more sets. Go 
line. Area one. So for today, that's your tutorial, quick tips on how to set the ball in a straight line. Big focus is index and thumbs finishing together, making sure that you're taking the ball consistently on top of your forehead to be specific, three inches from your forehead. Make sure you subscribe before you leave the channel. We'll see you next video. Thanks for watching. If you want more content like the content you just saw, make sure you subscribe to this channel. Know that every video we put out is gonna hit one of these six topics. So I want you to drop in the comments before you leave, put down what topic you'd like to see hit and which category it falls within. Let's keep getting to a new level.